So, if you've seen my last video about this Sony Vio that has an awesome RGB light, then you'll probably know that it has a smashed in power plug. And today we're gonna be replacing it with this. This type of plug is way more common than whatever the Sony used, and that'll make it extra more useful. Because normally you'll see these more than these on older laptops at least. So let's get this thing apart and replace the port. After removing all of the screws, we can remove this top cover. We need to unplug the RGB light. And there we go. We can remove this. And now I have to remove this fan to access the port. That's gonna be a problem though because I don't have any spare thermal paste. And let's take this broken port apart, that was easy. As we can see this is the negative and this is the positive. Now let's take this off and let's uh, solder the other port on, this one. Alright, the new port is soldered on. Let's plug it in and see if it works. And nothing's happening. Oh yeah, it worked. Let's add a little bit of glue. Let it dry. And let's put on some more glue, just to be safe. Let's see if my fix works. It does now. Does it spark when I open it? No, it doesn't. All right, now that the port is fixed, now we need to look for something to put on these uh, CPUs. Since I don't have any thermal paste, I might just cut off a piece of this and put it on the CPUs. Wow, look at that, that's dirty. All right, this should work. And no, I don't have to clean this out because it's uh, it's it's already clean. You can see it through it. And that's screwed in. Let's plug this in and see if it uh, overheats. Now, before we close it up again, let's uh, see if it works first. It really doesn't look that much better, but at least at least it works. Oh, we have power. Will it work? It does. And let's screw it back together. This is the finished product. Um, it might not look that good, but it's definitely better than this. Let's now turn it on a final time and see if it explodes or overheats. It's already blowing. Like, like the fan is already loud. Okay. And um, as you can see, it boots into the desktop, and the fan is able to keep the CPU cold. So that's a win to me. What is also a win is that we now have this this type of plug. So um, that was it.